Hello, welcome. I'm going to play Alex Kid, The Lost Stars on Sega Master System. It's a side scrolling platform game. So I'm not very good at it. <laughs> it's a short game, but I don't think I'm going to finish it by any means. Basically, uh, there's like six main levels and then they repeat. And they walk right into that. This is tricky. He doesn't jump very well. But there's a jumping power up. Problem is, is that that life bar. It's like a time limit as well. So you don't help. You know, you can't just take your time. I did just pick up extra health. This, it, it helps to drop off of that. You know, it's safe up there for the time being. Just because he moves faster on the ground. I want to get that. It gives him a shot. He's 19 shots. So if you miss a jump, I believe that's... That's it, you only get the one life. Oh, no. Oh, no. Good, they reset you. I wasn't sure. But I did lose my uh, weapon. Which is gonna make this tricky. Let's see. How much I can do? <laughs> you can't fit through there. I don't think. It, it didn't look like it. There's these guys near it. Toward the end of the level. These guys. I don't know how to get past them. Oh, I do have a weapon, but I don't think I can shoot the ball. Maybe I can shoot the guy up top. No. Oh, look at that. I squeezed through. He got extra life. I'm not sure what to do here. Just walk past him, I guess. <laughs> yeah, he can't really fight. Oh, there's the exit. Oh, I made it. Yeah, I really haven't played this game in a very long time. There's really no reason to because it's not not great once you finish it. No no uh nothing to pull you back in. It's I mean Alex Kid has a handful of games. Some okay, some not so great. His best game is probably his first, which I do not own. Alex Kid in Miracle World. I do have High Tech World, which is more of an adventure game, at least the, the early portion. So, need that. It was a Genesis game I used to own, but I got rid of it. Alex Kid in Enchanted Castle. That's the one where you can play rock, paper, scissors, or you have to with a bunch of enemies. This game really isn't hard at all, <laughs> but you know, when I talk and play, I'm not so good, and I, I don't really like platform games that much. I, I guess I used to play them, but rarely do anymore. Unless I'm playing a game for this channel. It's not something I usually buy new anymore. Because I never got into the Mario games. Because I didn't... Oh man. Oh. <laughs> I didn't even realize he was... 
I'm paying a closer attention. I didn't realize either. there was a bar to grab. I hit the jump button, which you know, drops you off what you're holding. Yeah, now I'm doing really bad. There's unlimited continues, but it, it just resets you at the start of the level. Shots. I always forget about the weapon though. Whoa. Oh yeah, that was a real short level. So I said the game is short, <laughs> it goes by pretty quick. This game is on the Wii Virtual Console, you know the Wii kind of old at this point, but if you really wanted to play it, that's an option. You'd have to already have bought it, though, obviously. The, uh... The store is gone. I don't know if you can buy those on current Nintendo platforms. never really looked. Oh. guy doing? <laughs> He's shooting out of his butt. Yeah, some kind of Japanese humor, I'm sure. Ugh. It doesn't even matter, I guess, I'm getting hit so often. I do have shots. Is a supposedly an arcade game. I don't know if it ever released in the U.S. Probably just in Japan. You can only go through there. Oh, I thought I didn't think I was close enough to get hit. Now yeah, my health is pretty low. Who can tell what I'm gonna hit coming down like that? Yeah, I gotta, you know, forget about that. I gotta <laughs> go fast. I'm about to die. Oh my god, I made it. Where in another couple seconds, I probably would have lost. I don't know what a great score is. In the manual, I wrote down one score, just 35,000. Alright, got a swimming level. Okay, I thought, I was thinking for a second, maybe that was like bonus points, but I guess not. They're pretty generous on these health uh, power ups. And I didn't think I was close enough, of course. I don't know if I ever finished Alex Kid and Miracle or not Miracle World or the High Tech World. It just gets so hard after the uh, the beginning portion. The beginning portion is just kind of running around and 
talking to characters and getting items. Then it's this. And there's a game called Alex Kidd and Shinobi World. But that second level is kind of... Makes me think of that. I don't, I don't know if it's similar. But there's a bunch of ninjas. And, and getting through a ninja forest. Oh, I thought I could go over him. Now I'm running out of time probably. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Look at that. <laughs> it's like just when I need it. Two bunches of health. Oh, and there's another one. And another one. Wow, they're really just giving them out. Quite a few shots, too. A little slow down there. Yeah, I thought that might hurt, but... Here's the exit right there. Oh, but they're gonna keep resetting me. <laughs> oh, I can't get touched. There you go. That's already four of the worlds. Only two remaining before they repeat, I believe. I'm thinking 35,000 isn't a great score. I don't know why I wrote that one down. I'm almost at 20,000. The pace probably didn't just never slow down and just go. I'm gonna run into things. Ah, oh, I thought I thought I was gonna make it. Ah, oh, I'm all the way back to the beginning. It sure wasn't that too it wasn't long ago, but Should have backed up. There we go, more health. Hmm, can I get up there? Oh, <laughs> oh okay, this one so I need to hit. jump across two at once. You see there's some graphics glitches kind of thing going on. They're uh, flickering. Alright, this is a boulder. Hey, you got a balloon. And it drops me perfectly on top of the enemy. Oh, that's not good. I think I want to be in there. <laughs> oh boy. Now I'm running low on health again. timing again. Yeah, I keep saying it, but this, this game is short. <laughs> but then you get to do it all over again, because that's exactly what I want to do. Find the miracle ball. I guess I'm going to show you all six worlds, because it, it, there might be other in-betweens, because I think there's 14 levels. I was looking at the manual. 
The other ones might just be like a kind of boss battle or appearance. He, helps get, he gets the weapon sometimes, but he's not really a fighter. He doesn't jump on things because he gets injured if he touches them. Yeah, bad timing. I could have used that. <laughs> no, I shouldn't have gone back for that. And every one of these things has hit me. New order droplets. Rolling head. I'll just keep shooting, maybe it'll hit something. Ah, oh, he hits his head. Oh, that's annoying. I lost my shots. Yeah, you gotta be careful when jumping, because it's... You bump your head, you just get shot right back down to the ground here. Oh boy. I jumped too late. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm gonna lose this level. Stupid time limit. Well, as you can see, you can continue. Fortunately, I gotta redo it. Which I know isn't the most exciting thing to watch, but. Ah, I was like. So close to grabbing that hell. That's. Oh, it's disappointing. I like the weapon. Whew, that's close. I can dodge these better. Nope. part again. I've got the better jumps, like... <sighs> the problem with the better jump, you stay in the air longer, so I should be trying to jump over two at once. Well, I don't have the better jump. Back to where I lost. I forgot to shoot or jump. Ugh, there's no way out of that. the exit. So close. Oh, 
Oh yeah, my score reset because I had to continue. So maybe 35,000 is okay. We have Ziggurat. Alright, this is an in-between thing. That's what, why there's 14 levels. It's, uh, it's not considered a world, I don't think. This manual even says there's only six worlds. And you float a little more in space. See, they don't tell you the story in the game. There is a story of Alex Kidd. In the first game, he learns he's royalty. I guess he gets his father placed back as king. And then, now he's on adventures. And the constellations have been stolen. That's why, you know, it's the lost stars. I don't remember the whole, <laughs> whole story. I don't have the back of this box. It's one of the few Master System games where I, I think I mentioned before, it's Rocky I'm missing the back on. I cut the backs of the box off for some stupid mail-in offer that I regret. Oh, it, it disappeared right as I was planning on landing. So now I, I like to, you know, scan boxes when I have them, but do I need to just hit this and go? <laughs> okay, I should be shooting, I guess. Stupid ziggurat. Do you want to watch me do this again? <laughs> Contemplate ending the video. I, I think you've now seen every background at least. When they, when they repeat... I think they do, do some variations at least. Could be wrong because I don't remember too well, but... You know, mix up the enemies or something. So it's not identical, but... But it... It could also be identical. <laughs> I don't think Sega went all out on this game. Yeah, dodging that ziggurat guy is a pain. Especially when there was... I don't know if slowdown helps or hurts. I mean, enemy moves slower than so do you. I don't know why I felt like that. <laughs> I thought I jumped. I am playing with uh, uh, Sega Genesis 6 button pad. Just because that's a bit more comfortable than anything else for Sega platforms. Aside from arcade sticks, but mine are so worn out they don't work well. But those Master System game pads aren't too great on the hands. Mesh system game pads, they're like a little bit, you know, more like NES pads. They're those rectangles with no curves, so it's, it's not really great to hold. I mean, the Genesis pads, a little bigger, and they have, you know, they're rounded on the side, so 
Yeah, here we are again. Gosh, these things are a pain to dodge. Oh, I was there. Yeah, what am I doing wrong here? I just jump. I hope I don't hit anything. <laughs> okay, if I die here, I'm just gonna end the video. Come on, get through. Oh, I stupidly forgot I had weapons. Oh, look, I made it. Because I remembered I could shoot. Yeah, without the shooting. That's a major pain to dodge those things. There's the constellations. I think it, he just repeats this whole thing again, and that's it. I might as well keep going until I... Lose again. There's, there's just, I don't think there's much of an ending other than that. So far, it looks identical. Yeah, maybe it is just playing the exact same thing again. Yeah, I had to continue a couple times, but... Maybe concentrate. And know the levels. Oh, <laughs> I was gonna hit that spring and bounce forward. And I messed up. The same. If you, you know, obviously I'm not concentrating that well, and I haven't played this game in forever. But even so, it's easy to just pick up and beat. Uh, this game and Vigilante is another unmatched system that you can probably beat the first time you play in under an hour. There are disappointing games like that, and part of it's just games in the past. Very basic, but still for 1988, definitely expect better than this. 88 would have been, I think, when the Genesis released in Japan. So this is at the tail end of. I mean, say I kept. I guess I should say. Say I did keep making. Okay, that had a few extra enemies, so it is a little different. Say I did keep making. Um. Games for the Master System, but some of them were just ports. They're most of them were ports of the Genesis games, like Sonic, Buster Douglas Boxing. Okay, so there's more of those cars dropping in. There are more enemies. Okay, I think that is a little different. There's some differences. Right at the end, but I'm gonna end it here. Obviously, there's not much difference, just those worlds repeating, as I said. So, thanks for watching.